What is good, YouTube? This is KChin8 coming back at you with another video on sneakers. <laughs> Today we got a just a sneaker review. And pardon me if you watched my uh, pickup since last video. My pickup since my last video. Video. <laughs> then I got the same shirt on because I'm filming in the same day. Um, anyways. As you can see in the background, I got my favorite Cardi Aventador and my other little goodies in the background. This is a Need for Speed, by the way, on the PS4. It's a freaking amazing game. So all you gamers out there who love cars, go get this game if you don't got it. Anyways, let's the sneakers. Jordan Box. It is Android 6 Maroon. Nike Air on the back. The amazing uh, rematch quality. I think they did a pretty good job on this actually. I could say it's rematched. Um, 220 is a bit steep, you know, a bit steep, but I wanted them and once I got them, I was like, it's worth it. <laughs> but I don't know if I can get it closer. Ooh. Um. Look at that tumble leather. Whew. Look at that. Sorry, the lighting is not that great over here. But look at that. Nike Air. This is about to die. I'm so sorry. Hopefully that the lighting gets better. Damn. All right, let me hurry up. <laughs> I'm prepared. Black people. Anyways... Uh, these are super clean, clean shoes. It's got a milky outsole instead of a, um, that blue tinted or all clear. Reminds me of the, the 7210 outsole or even the KD7 eggnog. Um, so it's, it's almost the same. But anyways, it's great quality. It's a great shoe. Um, go out and get you some if you like them. Um, it's really steep, but do it you know if you like them and they're still around they're still sitting on shelves strangely i mean it's a shoe with nike air on the back i think nike is uh just releasing a crap load of them and uh, obviously the 220 price point doesn't help them move off shelves so anyway that's another discussion for another video as well which i will do but um i just wanted to sh share this with you guys i know it's super late but better late than never also an interesting story of how i got them um, so I said my girl got these for Christmas for me, um, because in essence she did, <laughs> um, she actually copped a lot of things for me at Champ Sports, some of which I kept, um, I have, uh, she got me a couple hoodies, a couple joggers and stuff like that, and I knew that this shoe was not in my collection, it was still on the shelves, so I was like, eh, like bub. Maybe I can take some of the stuff back and use it towards the shoe. Um, so one day we were going out and I piled up all the stuff in the trunk. Um, and then we got in the car and I looked over and I was like, Babe, do you, um, would you be mad if I took some of the stuff back that you got me to get the Maroon 6s? Because, you know, I want them a lot. And she was like, no, of course not. Where's your stuff? I was like, it's in the trunk. And then she was like, so you was just going to do it anyway, whether I said yes or no. And I said, no, if you said no, I, I would have kept the stuff. But, you know, it kind of made me feel a little bad for, you know, exchanging it or whatever. But she's cool with it. She knows my love for sneakers and she knows that I really like this shoe. She actually doesn't, well, didn't like it. But when she saw it in, in hand at home, she said she was feeling it kind of. So, but anyway. That's how I got them. I also had a $20 reward with those guys, and I put it with it. So I ended up spending $2.74, I think. <laughs> it's a steal. But anyways, it's been real, guys. Um, I will be bringing an on-foot of these guys to you eventually um sooner rather than later put it like that 
But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Um, be great, be awesome, and signing off. This is Kate and Eight. Later.